this episode of Cash Canada, we're after five cash sizes in one day. We're starting off with a micro, getting a small, a regular, large, and ending up finding an other. And just like that, we're at the first one and it's called PMD. You know what that stands for. Pull me down. Yeah, and it's right there. Let's see if we can. <laughs> but it, this tree looks pretty thick for a PMD, but we'll see what you can do. Oh, we did it. <laughs> I didn't think we'd be able to pull it down. <laughs> that branch is so thick. We got it. I just don't want to let go. <laughs> okay, we got it. Ready? One, two, three. Whoa! Wow, we got that one. Let's hope we can find some more. Yeah, the next one's a small. Let's go get that one. Oh, I see it. Oh, I see it too. Yeah, I think we can get at it this way. Okay. There we go. Yep, yeah, that's a small. There we go. And that is a small. Next up, a regular. Oh, I hope we can find that one. Yeah, that one's kind of questionable. There wasn't anything within 50 kilometers. It's the closest one that we could find that we have not found yet. So, there, that's pretty good. Two down, three to go. We got the micro, the small, regulars next, large, then other. Could be anything. Could be a huge thing, could be small. Don't know, that could be the hardest one to get. So, this is a kind of cool challenge. Let's get that last one. Hey, that's the regular. I'm not going to quibble, but I think that's the same size as the small that we found. Just bring the camera closer, it'll look bigger. <laughs> okay. Yeah. There you go. There you go. go. <laughs> we found a regular. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know about size. Maybe it used to be a regular and it's been replaced at some point with this, but you know, <laughs> we got we got three so far. We got two more to go and <laughs> I don't know what the rest are going to be like. You never know. It might not be a large. We're signing with our initials 3LW because it's cold. So there you go. We got three, two more to go. We got a large and an other. Let's see if we can get those. So this large is on someone's property. Oh, let's see if we can be stealthy. Yeah, down the driveway. So, ooh, I don't know. Oh, I'm hoping we can find it and not be too conspicuous. Oh, there it is right there. I think. I'm hoping. Unless it's missing. Because I'm hoping that's not it. Oh, there it is right there. You can see the geocaching symbol. There you go. Oh, is it in there? Yeah! Yay. We got it! We got it. We got a large. That's awesome. Yay. Larges aren't very plentiful uh, where we are, so you really got to search for them. And they're more hard to find in the winter because they're usually on the ground. Yeah, so that's why uh, we used one of the attributes was winter friendly because we just recently got snow and you want to make sure you'll be able to find it. So, Well, that's the large and we'll put that back and the next one is an other. And yeah, that could let's be tricky. hope we can get that because those are kind of tricky yeah. sometimes. Because you don't know what they are. That could be almost anything. It could yeah. be a tiny little vial. It could be a medium, a regular. Like, who knows? So that's coming up next, the other. So this is the last one. Yep, this and, last one. And uh, this one is an other. And the hint is bone. Oh, because it's near the dog park. Yeah, it makes yeah. perfect sense. Yeah. And this cache is by a friend of ours, Star Runner. So mm -hmm. uh, we're really, really close. And I'm thinking it's in that tree right there. Yeah, let's have let's a, look. a look. Found it. Oh, cool. There it is. Oh, look, it's got eyes. Oh, neat. And it kind of looks like a bone. Kind of. <laughs> it's a whiz bang inside. So it was a camoed, bone-shaped container with a whiz-bang inside. Yeah. Pretty cool. 
So that was a really cool way of creating your very own mm -hmm. tailor-made adventure. Yeah, using the website and the app to get a variety of different parameters. Yeah, and we hope that you really enjoyed coming along with us because we're going to do some more adventures just like that. Keep watching, there's more caches to be found. And where will geocaching take, take you? you?